over five kicking techniques, which are side kick, round kick, hook kick, axe kick, and a combination of side kick, round kick. Hi, this is Emily, and this is episode 116 of the Mar SportMarshArts.com Minute. Today is Tuesday, December 17th, 2019. If you love sport karate competition, this is the show for you. The clock is ticking, so let's get started. Today is all about sport karate education, but first a shout out to Serafina Fish, who went to a school dance and then hightailed it across state lines to hit up a tournament the next morning. That is dedication. TEK Kickboxing handing out its year end awards to its students. Team Legend got bragging rights after winning overall grand champion in teams at the Campione del Turnio Copa Legend. At least I think that's what this says. Esteban Tremblay was the 14th to 17th overall boys weapons grand champion at the Toronto Tournament of Martial Arts Champions. Congratulations, Esteban. Now let's get to the education piece. We're bringing to you clips from Raymond Daniels teaching some of his great sparring skills. In this clip, he runs to the sidekick. First will be our sidekick. Now remember, we always want to do it from a bouncing position. Remember, keep your hands up when you're kicking. A lot of people develop a bad habit of putting their hands here. Now medium speed. Now full speed. Now take a couple seconds and practice that on your own. day of your birth to Gianluca Tiozo, Diego Urutia, Will Jackson, he's the coach of Teams Freestyle, Wilfredo Bersenio, Samantha Lane, e Emmanuel Ikpepemi, LD Adams, and Kelly Ormsby. Happy birthday to all, I hope you have a great one today. And here's kick number two with Raymond, the round kick. Our next kick will be our round kick. Once again, from the bouncing position, moving my hands around. Now at medium speed. Now at full speed. Now take a couple seconds, practice that on your own. tournament was a Team USA WKC qualifier and it looks like it was a really good time. Jacob Bianchi placed in a number of divisions at the Christmas Kumite. Dennis Cranston represented at the Kappa Classics Children's Tournament. And April Frogner took a first place at the Christmas Kumite Tournament. Congratulations to all who went out and competed. Raymond's now going to take you through the hook kick. Our third kick will be our hook kick. Once again, from a bouncing position, Make sure you tuck your hook kick, just like your side kick. First, we'll start off slow. Notice I reach out with my toes on my hook kick to get more reach and to make it a better looking technique. Now, medium speed. Now, full speed. Now, take a couple seconds, practice it on your own. a big announcement. Registration for the Compete Internationals is open. The event is a lot of fun and you should put it on your list. It's going to be held February 21st to the 23rd in Ontario, California. To register and to book your hotel room, go to compete-karate.com. In this next clip, Raymond has the tips you need to throw a tournament style axe kick. Next technique will be our axe kick. Now I see people throwing the axe kick incorrectly. They'll throw a dead leg kick, which is like that. On the axe, you want to bring your knee up into your chest. And then remember, when throwing the axe kick, you have to get at least your opponent's shoulder level. Since I don't have an opponent, it will be my shoulder level. Now, don't bring your axe kick up higher. This is going too high, and you don't really need to bring it up that high. Bring it right to the shoulder and bring it down hard. 
Okay, so again, bouncing on your toes. First we'll go slow. Once again, reaching out with my toes to get more extension. Now medium. Down full speed. Now take a couple seconds, practice it on your own. combination side kick round kick this technique in this session which we'll be going over is a side kick ground kick what you're doing is a side kick is making your opponent bring his hands down to protect and then which opens the round kick upstairs okay so bouncing on your toes of course we take our time do it slow now medium speed Make sure you try and keep your body up when you're throwing your kicking combination techniques. So that way it enables you to follow up. Now at full speed. Now I want you to take a couple seconds, practice on your own. Please take a moment to like and share this video and help me spread the word about our amazing sport. Time is up. Thanks for joining me today. See you next time on the SportMartialArts.com Minute.